Happening now, the Birmingham Sidewalk Film Festival celebrating its 25th anniversary. Yeah, it's a week for not only the city, but for local filmmakers looking to get some exposure. Taylor Pollock speaking with one Homewood native whose work is being screened. And Taylor, what does this mean for him? Well, Brittany, Steve, for many of these filmmakers, they're just excited to showcase their work to an audience in a traditional theater setting. And the people at Sidewalk want to make sure filmmakers everywhere know they're here to help them accomplish that. I'm always excited to see somebody who is from the state, you know, really showcase their talent. The Sidewalk Film Festival has lots of reason to celebrate this year. It's their 25th anniversary, and for the first time, they're expected to meet or exceed pre-pandemic revenue, with the festival estimating $1.5 million for the local economy. 225 new films premiere this week, many of them from local filmmakers. So yeah, we've got great amount of local filmmakers, and often, you know, what we see is they're not only showcasing their local talent, they're also showcasing local stories, which I think our audience really loves. One of those films, written and produced, by a Homewood native. We we made this film not only as a proof of concept for what our team can do, but what Alabama filmmakers can do. You know, it doesn't take a ton of money. You don't have to have studio connections. You can go out and shoot films with Alabama talent, cast and crew, and make something really special. And we hope that we did just that. The support cook says doesn't stop after the end of the week. Is figuring out how to lift up and support the local filmmaking community. And we've done that over the years not only through the annual festival, but also to be able to offer educational programs and networking events, which we do on a year round basis. Sidewalk does give out awards chosen by a panel as well as audience choice awards. But for Burgess, his film being screened for the hundreds of attendees is its own kind of reward. Uh, a lot of our friends have won Best Alabama Feature at the festival before, so to be in company like that would be nice. Uh, but we're just happy to, to be screening in front of an audience. You know, that's that's our reward this weekend. Don't Die, Burgess's film premieres Saturday at 8.30 p.m. The festival ends this Sunday. Brittany.